Okay, this morning I'm going to test out those this uh, new flight controller, which is an Acronice 32 <coughs> on this frame. I need to calibrate the speed controllers, I haven't done that yet. This is um, horizon mode. It feels very well connected to your input control or control inputs rather. I should have enough throws to do a, a flip. I don't want to do flips yet. I haven't had to add any expo or anything. <coughs> Excuse me. Very smooth. There you have it. It's just drifting back because of the breeze. Just very little this morning. <coughs> this controller is not as, sen as sensitive to vibrations after as the multi wing Nano I was using a few times on this frame. There's a little bit of oscillations there. Let's try a flip. Let's go high. No problems. Side flip. I need more rates. It's not enough to fly. This is Acro now. Very nice. No, this is not Acro, sorry. This is. Back to horizon mode. I'm getting a bit of oscillations there. <coughs> Excuse me, got a bad throat today. Um, those oscillations, I think, are due to vibration. These frames can be tricky with vibrations. The wooden frames I have are much better in that department. But those little oscillations don't affect much the way it flies when you fly around. But it would do if I have a camera on board. I have um, fitted the flight controller with a buzzer and connected the controller to the um, distribution board to get the voltage. Basically, I'm hoping to to see the low battery voltage alarm working. And I think indeed that was the alarm. I set the alarm to 3.5 volt. per cell
Well, there we have it. It's flying good. Could be a bit better, I guess. If I get rid of these vibrations. <clears throat> but this is practically stock settings when it comes to the, um, the gains. I really would like to exhaust the battery a bit more to see that I'm working. Okay, that'll do it for today. Thanks for watching.